flaws in this video we will see how to create model or entity object for example in any database we have employee class for example we have employee class in that employee class we have employee id first name last name email and mobile number so on so all these fields we have from this we have to create entity object or model class entity class or model class for that in this package like uh, com.ssit.app.model class i have created one one class called employee first this class have annotated as a entity For that, how to annotate as a table? If you are not to annotate as a direct table, automatically by default, our project uh, it will create employee table. By using a direct table annotation, we can specify the name of the table, like which type of the, what is the name of the table. Table here we are creating the employee table. The name of the table is employee table. Employee underscore table. After that, how to create the pop uh, these columns? Employee ID, first name, last name, email, all this number. Before that. For creating any model or entity class, you have to follow some rules. Like that class has to be public, and the properties, all the properties should be private. Every property should have setters and getters, and it has to be default constructor. See, for example, here we have employee ID. This employee ID has to be integer. Like. This property should be private first, then return type. Integer. Then what's the name of the property? Employee ID. This is the process. How to create that variable name? Variables are properties in a model class. Here, I am writing one annotation column. Here, I am specifying. Without uh, specifying the column, also we can uh, write the all the properties. If you are not writing uh, this column property, uh, column annotation directly, it will create employee ID as a columns in the table. Here, I am specifying. Name of the column is M E M P I D. Just I'm copying this. Name of the column is employee ID. Correct. This is ID column. I'm suspending with this ID. This ID, I don't want to uh, give from program. This ID should be generated. From program. For that, I will use the annotation as generated. I will use this annotation generated value. Value. So, start again. Then strategy equal generation type equal to auto. Then second column here first name. First name should be string. Private string. First name. 
first I will create all the properties then last one here then email this all are string only that's why I copy here email then mobile number then date of birth here date of birth is the date field private date we'll use java dot util date date of birth then date of joining is also same thing date of join then pending is create a date and time i wait For this we will use time. For this also I am using date only. Now here columns, column, name, first name. For this last name, for this email, mobile number. Data of birth, data of join. This is created data type. For organize imports, control shift O. For creating two string methods, the shortcut is Alt Shift S plus S. Creating setters and getters, the shortcut is Alt Shift S plus R. We select all. Creating constructor. The shortcut is Control Shift plus S plus O. 